The man behind the victory of State of Origin, Maroon's team, is back on deck to see Team Kumul through to the World Cup Challenge. Mal Manninger is optimistic for the boys to execute an outstanding performance when taking on Scotland in a pre-World Cup match. I, I get a lot of enjoyment out of you know, being involved with the Kumuls. Um, it's, again, it's very satisfying to, that I can actually put back into the game of rugby league here in Papua New Guinea. I've been coming up here for such a long time and it's good to see everyone's aligned. Yeah, it's good to see the government and the PNG Rugby League um, aligned with you know, rugby league here and in uh, Papua New Guinea. And Players know what to expect both on and off field. Vipers inside centre and current Kumul player Richard Campbell believes in on field discipline. Discipline and a lot of talk. Especially communication is the biggest thing in every game in rugby league. So to win a game, you have to be the better talking side and especially discipline when you are tagging in defence. It's all add ups, add ups to discipline. Team Kumul I performance training camp has ensured players are well equipped in their ball handling and tackling. And on field communication is paramount. There's hope that Kumul will make it good or do better in the World Cup 2013. Through our participation at Team Kumul camps like this, I'm hoping the 24 players we have here and the coaching staff we have here can go back to wherever in the country they've come from and impart the knowledge, the world of knowledge that we have access to now. The team's schedule is out, including the Prime Minister's starting challenge, which will be held on the 29th of September at the Calabon Oval in Kokopo, East New Britain province. Tara Alex, Trukai Sports.